All right, all right, what's good? You know what time it is for another beer review. Now, I don't do awards, but if I had to do an award for beer of the year, this is it right here. This spotted cow, I had it a few years ago when I first went to Wisconsin, and I forgot how good it was, and it's only available in Wisconsin. There's like some kind of strict law that you're not even allowed to transport it. Like, why are you being so selfish? Why can't the rest of the world be able to purchase this beer? It is really, really good. Definitely one of my favorites. This is a go-to. Um, well, I bought some in a suitcase, so I did travel with it. And I loaded it in my bag around my uh, clothing. So I got myself a six-pack. But if you're in Wisconsin or if you know anyone that can get this and you want to try a great, regular, everyday beer, this is it right here. This is it. I don't know why it's so hard to get. But if you're in Chicago and you can cross over, I highly recommend it. I'm probably asking for an accident. Look at the length I go, social media fam, to pour a good glass and be able to record at the same time. Oh, shit. I'm actually impressed that this worked. Because I would have been very upset if this would have spilled. And it did. And it did. And this was my last beer. And pretty much all of it is, uh, wow. Okay, now that that fiasco is over and I literally wasted, um, I don't know, half, more than half of my favorite beer, beer of the year, the go-to. This is good summer, winter, all year round has a great smell. It's crisp. Fuck. It's a crisp beer. It's it's just good. It's just a good everyday beer. It's like uh, Samuel Adams if it was lighter, crisper. I don't know. I don't know what else to tell you. It's a good beer. I already said it. it's beer of the year for me. If you watch my videos, you know what I'm into. This is just a great beer. I'll break down the nonsense later.